Hello and welcome to our video. My name is Shaden and in this video we'll go ahead and look at styling our farm labels in the JD Builder Farm Builder. Let's get to it. The labels can be found here and all the labels are styled at the same time. To, to explain what a label is, it's this text that appears here. So you have a few options. You can either disable the labels altogether and that leaves you with something like this, but you can go ahead and add placeholders. So you can do this. Oh, one second. Okay, there you go. So you can do something like this. And placeholders are actually fine. They're used in a lot of modern farms. So it just depends what your use case is. Some people still try to use labels. Let me just add this. And the fourth one, so it looks nice. So placeholders are fine too, but sometimes you wanna add labels just because they're good for accessibility. So there you go, they work good with placeholders and without. Now, the second option is if you wanna have the required mark, which means this red sign, this will only appear if the field is actually required. So if I um, make this name and email fields unrequired, you'll see it'll go away from here. But whether or not the field is required, uh, it required is irrelevant to this. So you can disable this, and even though these fields are required, that will pop up after you after the user tries to submit. So there's that. The next is the inline label options, which means you have the labels to the left of the form rather than having them towards the top of the form, uh, top of the fields. So you lose all flexibility and you just have a single row of fields from top to bottom. But here you have flexibility for the width. So you can decide what the width of your labels would be. You can keep them small if you don't have a lot of fields or however you like or however much spacing you have. Uh, the next option is the color for the label. So this is just a text color. You can give it a fancy color if you want to. So maybe we'll give it something like this. I mean, a greenish color, which looks weird, but there you go, okay. Or maybe we'll give it purple. Yeah, okay, that's a fancy color. And then obviously you have typography. You can change a different font, increase the font size, and do a whole bunch more. So, you know, just, just regular typography that you have available throughout the builder. And really, that's it. That's how you do labels. Oh. I forgot one thing, that's label spacing. So if you don't do inline labels, uh, you, you'll see that the label width is actually replaced with label spacing, which is the space between the label and the field below. So you can increase this to kind of increase the comfort within your farm and see what, what you want this option to be. And that's it. Now that's uh, for the labels, that's how you style and use labels in the farm uh, component in JD Builder. Thanks for watching.